This video is meant to show how to manage users on your My League Online website. When you're logged in as a League Webmaster and you go to your League, if you scroll down, you will see this Administer League menu on the left-hand side. One of the options here is Manage Members. If you click on this, it will show you all of the members of your League right now. At the moment, I'm actually logged in as this user, Rainbow Bright, who is the administrator member of this specific league. From here, I'm able to add a member. And if I click on this Add Member link right here, I can now do a search for a user. Let's say that I would like to add Elizabeth Leslie. I'll start typing in her name and see what comes up. Now usernames are not always obvious. Typically we're going to give the username as the first name and last name of the individual, but in the case of Elizabeth Leslie, it's E. Leslie. So if I just start typing and wait, it will give me recommendations for people that I can choose from. Once I know that I've found the right person, I can select that individual and then click Add Users. Once I've added a person to the league, I can edit that user, if I would like to, and turn them into an administrator member on this particular league site. Update membership, and now this person is an administrator and can manage this league. I don't have to make a person an administrator member. If I don't make them an administrator member, then being added to this list will give them access to members only content, but it won't give them the ability to edit the pages and content and add new content to your league. If you're, if you're looking for somebody who doesn't come up in that list, let me click on this again. If I start typing in someone, let's say that I have a person named Samantha Orange and I want to add her. So I start typing somebody in and I type in Sam or Orange and I'm not getting anyone that might be Samantha Orange. At that point I can create a new user. This form allows me to create a username. We would like to use the standard of first name last name so in this case it would be Samantha Orange and then their email address. This should be their email address, their unique personal email address, because this is an account that they can use individually, not one that they're meant to share with other people. It's also where a password reset request would go, and it's also the account that's used in revision management on content to see who made what changes. I'll create a password for them. I do have to type it in twice. And then I will make sure that the user is active so that they can log into the site. If they're blocked, they won't be able to log into the site. And then the rest of this, you can fill in for them or you can let them fill it in themselves. Then you'll click create a new account and that will create the user. From there, you can then go ahead and go back to the user add page. There's this link right here to reload this page so that it knows to find that new user and then start typing in that new user's name and you'll be able to add them to your site. I'm going to go back because I don't actually want to add any other users to this specific league. But once I've done that, now the user is either a member or an administrator member depending on what I've set that user to be.